No, <laughs> why'd you look away? High five! No, no, no. Alright, so welcome to Look at the Camera. Welcome oh, Dad, no tricks! Alright, alright, let's get started with the show. Thanks for watching. episode of Old Dog and New Tricks. All right, so today uh, we're going to do another game that is based on um, spy stuff and everything. So I thought today, today's episode is called Jazz Punk is the name of the game that we're going to be and playing. And also our... And so because it's a spy type espionage game, I figure the book that's going to be the sponsor for today's game is one of my spy novel in my spy series, Peacekeepers X Alpha. So in my Peacekeepers X Alpha world, I have uh, season one, episode four, the alternate world, and so that one is Let's my spy thriller, look. and really good. Ooh, alternate world. <laughs> all right. So uh, thanks everyone for subscribing. Thanks to all our subscribers. Uh, we love you guys and gals. Thanks so much for subscribing to our channel, guys and I hope yeah. you're enjoying all these games. We're sitting there enjoying making them and having a lot of fun playing together, and a lot of good father-son bonding time. Yeah. Ooh, two on one. Beautiful. All right. So let's go ahead and let's switch on over. Jack and this is uh, we're gonna check out this new game called Jazz Punk. Never played it here, so let's see what it looks like here. So we're starting a new game, so let's see what we got. This looks like an airline terminal. In China. Oh yeah, could you read some of those characters? You're learning Chinese. Oh, oh here comes luggage. Here comes all the luggage. I, I, I know that one, I just can't remember the name. Oh, okay. Oh, look, are we in a piece of luggage? That looks like a person-shaped luggage. Ah, Necrophone Games Presents. So can you read some of those characters? Oh. Oh, electronic symbols, circuits it looks like. Are they scanning everybody? Oh, oh no, there's a person inside that one. It wasn't electronic. Oh, dumped him into a funnel. Oh boy. Let's turn this down first. Okay, so, oh. It's like old archaeo pictures, way before anybody's time. And there's cars on the freeway. Buildings and also like circuits looks like. Airplanes. This is like the intro to all the uh, spy movies in the 60s. All the James Bond and the Man from Flint and the birds. Oh, did you see the feathers? The birds got sucked into the engine on the plane. Oh man. Oops, uh oh, wiretap. Somebody's listening in on that phone call. Yeah, there was a wiretap between those two phone calls. Uh oh. And it's on an old computer. Real to real like a, tape. This looks like an old game, but it's really new. Yeah, it's a new game, but they did an old style. Wow, that's a lot of psychedelic stuff hitting that <laughs> flying at me here. This is crazy. Oh, this wow. has hurt my eyes. I know, it's like, oh, oh, okay, what do we got here, what do we got here? Spy! Alright, let's see, we're a spy. Looking around, hold on, let's look around first, let's look around first, what do we got? Oh, look! We came out of that case we saw. There's that case. Yeah, so where did we all go? We went to Lisbon, Fiji, we've been to Hawaii, Jakarta. We've been all over the place. Algiers. Wow, we were kind of all over the place. Let's see. What do we have here? We have here a uh, door. Reginald Aubrey Turing Finances. Can I open the door? No, it doesn't look like it. Turing Finances. Oh, we have another door here. Lauren and Kosh. Quantitative Accounting. That sounds pretty scary. Ooh, a box. Can we open it? Pick it up? <laughs> I'm just a box. Leave me alone. Okay, let's try it again. No. Okay. All right. We can't play with the box. Can't play with the box. Is can't, that a lie? Can't open box? the doors. Import export limited. I don't know. The box was talking to us. Let's see. There's an open door. Now ah, let's go past it. Let's see what's down here. I see a box under over here. 
Think we get something over here? All right, what do we got? What do we got? Can I click on it? Can't okay. click on that box, no. There's some other. There's some more of the boxes. Other boxes. All right, let's go look at these boxes. Hey, look, maybe I can read. Them. Nope. Nope. Oh, can't oh. click on it. Can you recognize the character? Nope, I can't. No, and haven't learned those ones yet. No, I don't think so. You've been doing uh, what, Mandarin? Mandarin. Chinese for about two years, three years now. Sit yeah. down, honey. Oh. The director will be right with you. What did she say? I'll be right with you. The director will be with you shortly. I'll be sure to tell him. Sit oh. down, honey. Oh, the director will be right with you. Okay, all right. She wants me to sit down. The seat. Can I see anything over here? Saxophone lesson. Uh, for sale. Uh huh. Okay. Let's see. This is a real fast response on the computer here. There's a for sale 1949 car. Two door manual transmission, 12 track lithium disc player, uranium 236 rods recently replaced. Reactor has been fully serviced. That's a nuclear car. An atomic car. Please, oh, press E to sit down. Okay. So let's come over here. And I'm I've seated. Peruse the articles. What's a peruse? The director is ready for you. needs to look at. So VR guide. Does Virtucon scanning cause schizophrenia? Okay. Reader's digestive organs instead of Reader's Digest? Oh, black market pricing guide. Oh, uh, no thanks. Soak, the wetware enthusiast magazine. We compare 13 biode socket lubricants. Barrier nodes, are they safe? Non-stick catheters. All righty. Playbot, uh oh, oh dear, oh dear. All right, okay. So we've looked at all the magazines. Can you hit E again and get out? Let's see, I don't know. Uh oh, they're stuck on the chair. Can I get out? What is it? Oh, I clicked the mouse button and that seemed to have got me out of the chair. The director will see you now. Oh, he'll see me now, okay. He must be through those doors, right? So, oh, they opened it. I think I heard something open. No? Can I look at anything here? Advanced neurogenics and radionics. Oh, these doors opened. All right. Please, have a seat. We've much business to discuss. Okay, it says have a seat. Press E to sit down a bit. It says, yep. Basically, that we us? need you to infiltrate the Soviet consulate. I saw a whoopee cushion. Oh, there was a whoopee cushion on our seat? He They've says, taken some of our important okay, technology so said, and it's imperative that we get it back on the right hands. Find As the... per usual, here's your mission or subscription. Okay. Don't take too many. Oh, don't take too many. If you need me, I'll be in the wine cellar. Where's he going? He just went downstairs behind his desk. Let's go see what's... See, look back at the seat. Oh, there's a whoopee cushion on it. Huh, okay. He just disappeared behind his desk. Well, go see what's behind his desk. See, there's a... He's sleeping under his desk. The wine cellar. He must have drank too much. Let's see. He said to take those pills. Before we pick those up, because that'll probably make us do a mission... Is there anything else? All right, so we are supposed to uh, infiltrate the Soviet consulate. Should I go get my Chinese books? And, yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> I don't And obtain the data cartridge. Okay. Oh, Chinese. All right, so let's go ahead. Because I know one of them. Oh, take one capsule every mission or until reality is sufficiently augmented. This is missional... Amphibamine dextrose. Okay. Okay, so how do you take one? I don't know. You should take mm -hmm. one right now. Oh, I did. I clicked the button with it in my hand. Starting mission in three, two, one. All right, let's see where this uh, takes. Jazz Pop! Woohoo! Sleeping under his desk. That's a crazy uh -huh. Oh, infiltrate the Soviet consulate. Good 
50s jazz, 60s jazz, whatever. Let's see. Oh, there's a guy over there in a trench coat and hat. Let's go talk to him. Oh, look. He's got a pull string on his back. It's a robot. Is it a robot? He's got a trench coat on. Think we can pull on that pull string? Oh, yeah. We sure can. Believe in yourself. Uh-oh. Believe in yourself. Best friends forever. Oh, he says platitudes. Right away you sleep at night. Um, okay, moving on. <laughs> Uh-oh. That was a threat. Alright. What do we got here? Somebody sitting on a bench. Smoking. Can you talk to this person? Oh, he's got a newspaper. Oh, look, I can look at it. Chief of police caught wearing fake mustache. Mine's real. <laughs> I'm so ashamed. Look away, says the chief. Okay, so that's the newspaper. Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you? Don't let me talk to you. No. Still smoking. Yay, smoke. Oh, look, I'm leaving footprints behind. Oh, as I walk backwards, I'm leaving footprints behind. So if I turn around, yeah, I can see where I walked recently. Hey, look, there's another guy with a newspaper and a trench coat. Pigeon? Hey, pigeon. Pigeon? Pigeon? Oh, oh, scared him. Scared the pigeon away. Should we see what this guy in the... Oh, pigeon's sitting on top of him. Do you have the MacGuffin? Oh, do I have the MacGuffin? In storytelling, that is the... Do you have the MacGuffin? I do not have the MacGuffin. Come back when you've got the MacGuffin. I will come back when I have the MacGuffin. Uh, apparently the MacGuffin is going to be the data recorder tape thingy. You've got the MacGuffin. The Mac so the MacGuffin. MacGuffin in a story is, is the goal. The item that you want to get. It's the one unique item that will enable the hero to defeat the villain and will enable the villain to accomplish their evil nefarious goal. Ooh, there's something on the ground. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Feel lost? Stuck in life? Call the Hint helpline. We'll set you on the right path. Call toll-free 555-HINT. Two dollars per minute. Oh, and there's a phone. I don't think I need a hint, so I'm not going to call the hint line right now. Call I think I'm okay. We I haven't, we haven't tried have. stuff. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, look. This looks like the Russian consulate we're supposed to uh, break into, right? Let's go talk to her. Maybe we, she'll let us in. I'm afraid you don't have appointment. Oh, uh, no appointment. Okay. Oh, oh, there's something on the desk here. Transferring file from desktop. <laughs> it's a desktop. And it said, I think it said readme.txt. wonder what that did. wonder what that did. I don't know. But we, we took it from the desktop. There's a newspaper. I think we can click it like we did the other one. Oh, yes, we can. Temporal shifting decriminalized, meaning you can now legally go around, move around with time. Time heads celebrate by going back in time. Mega Corp CEO declares Uno. Uh oh, there's there's a monopoly now. All right, so what do we got here? Let's go talk to this guy. Oh, oh, there's uh, dotted lines around that. I think that means we can do something at the clock. Should we go talk to this guy? You have insufficient security clearance. Oh, insufficient security clearance. I'm afraid I must ask you off premises. Oh, we must leave. Okay, all right, no problem. Well, let's see. I hear a clock ticking, so that's kind of leaning me over. Huh. So, lunchtime, communist plotting, vodka and biscuits? Potato sack race. <laughs> well, let's see, we can click on the clock. Oh. Oh. Press space to exit. Well, I have a hand. So what do I do? Oh! I can move the time around. I can move the... What do I do? 12 o'clock? 12 o'clock. Should I make it 12 o'clock? Was that lunchtime? 
not. Ooh! And then press space to exit. Oh look! All the workers are leaving. Whoop! Oh, I dropped my thing. Oh, oh! Oh, hello. Oh, and he said in Russian, he's watching me. I'm trying to hold the clock. Okay, all right, all right, we'll leave, we'll leave. <laughs> There's a hand that I used to change the clock. <laughs> okay. It's now, it's now 12 o'clock. We've gone back in time. Can I talk to her? She's on break at lunch, so it's lunchtime. What does the newspaper say? Registry. Same thing. They celebrate by going back in time. Alrighty. Ding. Oh, he's still watching he's me. He's following are. I'm. I'm leaving. I'm leaving right now, sir. I'm leaving right now, sir. Thank you for your patience. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm leaving. Hey, the workers left. Going long. Gone luncheon. Back in five minutes. Oh wait. There's something. Oh. <gasps> Hey, that's the thing that they use to work on the building. Find the mailbox oh. marked with chalk on the side. Find the mailbox marked with the chalk mark on the side. Oh, okay. Alrighty. So... Okay. Alright, I will do that now, sir. I think I need to find a mailbox. I want to go see the big sleep mode, but they say I'm too young to get in. I want to see the big sleep mode, huh? Okay, alright. What's the big sleep mode? I don't know. Apparently this is, uh, so I'm looking for a mailbox with a chalk mark on the side. Is that a mailbox over there? Can I jump? Can I jump? Yes, you can. Okay. I got a hair in my mouth, alright. Can I, I can't seem to jump over the fence. I can't seem to jump over the fence, but maybe there's a spot where I can get through. Now, that's the guy that I pull a string and he talks. Ah, I can cross the street with this, it looks like. Oh, there's a newspaper on the ground. President calls robot leprosy a good thing? Neurotech invents 10 arm decapus instead of an octopus, which has got eight arms. Is it still an octodad or is it a decodad now, right? <laughs> One of the other games. Oh no, I knocked him off! Oh no! What'd he say? I don't know. I, What'd I'm he say? Okay. I'm okay! I knocked him off the thing! Did not see that coming. <laughs> Thermo optics. Right, I'm looking for a mailbox with chalk mark on the side. Oh, that's, a that's, a, that's a newspaper. Oh, that's the newspaper that we've been doing, right? <laughs> Sam's crossing his head. Can I, can I click on this? No? Alright, I saw a blue mailbox somewhere. It's on the that side. Here it is. What do we got over here? There's stuff back here. What's that? Placebo? Do I want that? Extra strength placebo. Do not use over or under water. For fast, effective relief of everything. Oh, I'm turning my head sideways because it's all written sideways as you can see. For fast effective relief of everything and anything causing physical or psychological distress, dosage for humans over age of consent, one caplet as often as necessary, dosage for simulants, one caplet every 108.034 clock cycles, medicinal ingredients, cornstarch glucose, keep out of reach of larva. Okay. Oh, what does that say? It said about something about my inventory. Never take... Uh, I don't know, that fell down, the sign, whatever that said, it fell down. Alright, I'm still looking for that mailbox that the guy told me to grab. Hello, my name is my Johnny. My name is Johnny, too! Yeah. Who's Johnny, he said. My mother never taught me to okay. speak and spell. <laughs> I got an idea. When I was growing up, speak and spell was a robot, uh, a thing this that button. we used to have, a toy. Oh, Pull my oh. finger. Oh! Whoops! He didn't fart. No, he didn't. He fell apart. All right, I'm not gonna pull this thing anymore. <laughs> Let's go find the mailbox with the chalk mark on the side. Okay, I found a mailbox. 
So chalk mark on the side of this mailbox. Garbage can. Can we do something with the garbage can? Go away. Go away. Oh no, the spy is still there. Oh, it knocked it over. Alright. Hey, there's a TV. I am always drawn to television. There's another bird. Can I do anything with the TV? Doesn't look like it. Do anything with the TV. Alright. Oh, is that a door? It says a door. Can I go through the door? Nope, probably not yet. I'm probably going way out of my balance here. Okay, yeah, jumped over that. Alright, still looking for a blue mailbox. Ah, here's another blue mailbox. Ooh! Look, 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 look. Chuck mark E equals NC squared. Alright, I found the blue mailbox. Oh! There's somebody inside. There's a man at the park sitting on a bench. Deliver this package to him. Oh, take the package to the informant in the park. That's the guy that said, Do I have the MacGuffin? Dad, look! Press Q to cycle inventory. That's all you have to do. Okay, I thought I picked up those placebos. Alright, so the guy in the park. Remember the. Okay, and we're recording on. Sorry about that. We uh, had a sudden mm -hmm. shutdown in the power of the entire house. Grandpa. And everything. So, yeah, we have the electrician overlooking at something. So, let's go ahead and uh, let's continue where we left off. Let's go pick up that thing from the mailbox that we were just at. So, I got, us, I got us all caught up to where we were in the game before the power was shut down from the house. Okay. Oh, get closer again. Okay. My settings messed up, got messed up here. Here we go. Can I click? There's a man in the park. Take the package. The okay, Move good. So, we, this must be the MacGuffin. Press Q to cycle inventory. Okay. So, let's go on and let's go find that guy. Oops. Alright. Yep, there's that poor guy laying in the street I knocked down earlier. He says he's okay. He swears he's alright. Oh, went too far. Okay. There we go. Let's go take this. I know, I know. Well, I had to knock him down again. I had to do everything the same so that we can get caught back up to where we left off before the power was suddenly interrupted. The things you deal seat, with. But keep your eyes forward. Okay. Have a seat. But keep your eyes forward. Take a seat. All right. I think we have to E to take a seat. Just like before, where it says to E to take a seat. Have a seat. Locate there. the newspaper box marked with a piece of chewing gum. Find the newspaper box marked with chewing gum. Okay. So did I give him... All right. I don't have anything. I'm hitting Q. Nothing in the inventory. So, so now I need to find... Locate the newspaper box marked with a piece of chewing gum. Alright, so we need to find the... Alright, so let's go back across over because we found a newspaper box, right? Okay, well let's go back. Oh, what's this? All I got for lunch is Windex. Xerox Park. Oh, I took a picture. I took a Xerox of it. <laughs> Alright, those I are the workers. Married, you goob. I'm Look, married. The player won't even notice. This is just incidental dialogue. Uh, is it... You think we should leave that running? <laughs> hey, you paid the wife, not think. <laughs> this is incidental. What you got for lunch? What'd you bring for lunch? All I got for lunch is Windex. <laughs> What's Windex? It's How the spray you we use to clean windows. Yeah. All I got is a ham sandwich. <laughs> Incidental conversation. So, uh, how's the notice? wife and kids? How's the wife? I ain't married, you goob. Married. 
Look, the player won't even notice. This is just incidental dialogue. <laughs> incidental uh, dialogue. You think we should leave that running? All right. So let's see. Can I talk to this guy again? I know he still wants me to find, but I want to get inside, don't I? You receive further instructions from there. Okay. So he wants me to find the le, the newsstand with the chewing gum on the side. So let's go back it's across. Probably that newsstand. So let's go, go back. On the other side. Across the street again. All right, let's go across the street again. Now go the other way this time. Go the other way? This way. What's this? Everybody waiting for a movie? A cult is my password. The big sleep mode. Oh, that's a little kid over there that says, I want to go see the big sleep mode, but they won't let me. I'm too young. Johnny pneumonia. Quadruple indemnity. <laughs> oh, truck's going back. Uh-oh. We triggered the truck to do something. That's not a milk truck. Look at all the antennas on it. Yeah, he's spying on somebody. The show is starting shortly. Show starts in one minute. Oh. We can go see a movie instead. Go on in whenever you feel like it. Whatever. Yeah, go on in. Please don't forget to buy our overpriced concessions. <laughs> <laughs> no. What's this? What's this on the ground? I need your help. I'm trying to get free Wi-Fi from Starbucks. But I dropped my password cracker on the road. Frogger! We have a game of Frogger! We have to go get the password cracker. Oh! Flattened frog. Again? Yes. Oh! Boy, this is tough. Should we do the. <laughs> He's got casts on his legs. Oh, I thought I had stopped it far enough away. Ah, please, no more. We're gonna do it anyway. Oh! <laughs> Are you mad? Oh, I don't know how I can do that. I, I was never. Okay. Make a run for it. Oh, I don't think we can go fast enough. Oh, I can't. Oh, my goodness. I have to get there and get back. Oh man, that, I have to get there and get back. At the right time. Oh man, can I get there just by getting there? <laughs> the frog's all getting casts and band-aids. Alright. Oh, ho, ho, ho! so close! <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh man! All right, I'm gonna have to time this. All right, this is now. I have to try to do this. Just gotta get this frog as password Froggy. thing. It's Frogger. All right. Oh! You caught it. Did I get it? No. You gotta stay off my wrist there. You gotta get there and back. Oh, can I get up against the edge of the road over there? No. I don't think you can go fast enough. Almost. Alright. He's frog. Oh, come on! I surely should have had that. Can you X out of this? Oh, and then there's nowhere to hide on the other side. I think oh, I've gone you. too far. I need to go here. Oh! 
Oh, and I gotta get back? I don't think I can do this. You can, Dad. Dad, you can do it. Oh! There must be a specific way. Uh oh, what's that? Okay. No, see, and there's nowhere to hide. Once I get there, I think we have to watch it carefully for the pattern that will let me do it. Right? So now... Oh! I I don't know if I would have had that. Okay. So... I don't know. I'm, I'm you don't trying have to see. To keep on doing this. You no, I don't. All right, that poor frog. All right. So we're looking for the new Hello, stand with the bubble gum on the side. Jolly, too. Oops. What is that? A sandwich? Sorry, ham. Oh, I just ate a sandwich. Mm hmm. Is this the one with the gum on it? Get a job. Okay. This must not be the one with the gum on it. All right. Let's go find the one with the gum on it. All right, here's another one. All right. I seem to be having trouble getting close to it here. It moves so fast. Get a job. Is there another one to try? I don't know how basketball looks like. <laughs> I'm Harlem look out, Globetrotters. Dad. Look back. It's yeah, still there. Harlem Globetrotters. Alright, here's another one. Is this one with the gum on the side? Yes, this is one with the gum on the side. Open the new box. You're almost there, Agent. Go to the Raytheon Motel. Knock on the door using the secret knock. <laughs> He's knock a very correctly, knock. and you'll be let inside. <laughs> Use the secret knock. I'll calibrate your sensor for a dollar. Uh, no thank you, that's quite alright. What's that mean? I don't know, but I'm not interested. Alright, it said to go to the hotel and use the special knock. Hotel, so, motel. There's a motel. Is there a motel? Over there. That way. Oh, turning? Oh, the other way. Yes, that motel. Oh, is that where you said to go? You said motel. Go in using the special knock. Hey, hey, let us in. Let us in. All right. Well, I think that's good for now. We're going to go ahead and save the game here. Save complete. And hey, thanks for enjoying us and uh, suffering through us with the uh, sudden loss of power as uh, the sudden. the electrician who was here to work on the house, he did not let us know he's going to be shutting down power in our part of the house to work on something else. And so he shut down power everywhere and we just suddenly went dark. So hey, thanks for sticking with us through this. And again, today's episode being a spy game, Jazz Punk, we're going to play this some more. This was a lot of fun. Was brought to you today by a... Season 1, Episode 4 of my book, The Alternative World, Peacekeeper 6 Wait Alpha. A minute, Dad. What? There's a piece of gum on it! <gasps> There's gum on the side of that book! Alright, so You're thanks a lot. Open. Thank you very much for watching and for all of our subscribers. Thank you so very much. We couldn't survive without you guys. So thanks a lot. And if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and do so at the bottom and uh, check out all the links on all my books down below. Have a very good night! Yeah.